so this is going to be another cleaning video i'm going to try and post one every single week on a sunday hopefully fingers crossed if you want to become a member on my channel then please click the join button which is next to my icon next to subscribe where you will see exclusive videos relating to my pregnancy and the baby and my whole journey with that i did post a video before this explaining that but that would really help me out and that would really help the baby out because obviously money is like not something I have tons of so for me that would really support me and it means that you get to see videos that other people haven't seen but today's video which is free not a members video I am going to be cleaning my bathroom top to bottom well not top to bottom that's a total lie but I'm going to be doing my weekly clean of my bathroom usually I will do a thorough clean of it every so often but every week this is kind of like my little bathroom clean routine so I'm starting the day off with a nice hot drink. I got this cute little sheet mug from Morrison's and I really, really like it. I feel like the drink tastes better in a mug that looks adorable like that. Like I said at the start of the video, I am going to be tackling my bathroom today. I'm cleaning my toilet, sink and bath and I'm going to be hoovering, mopping and wiping surfaces. Yes, you can see my dogs in the background. You'll probably always see the dogs in the background to my videos. They're just doing their own little thing, but I crack on with the cleaning. I also do apologise. I look very, well, I look like a mess. <laughs> Let's put it that way. This is what I look like on a Sunday morning, typically when I'm just cleaning. I just get up and I just crack on with the cleaning and then I get ready later on in the day because I just feel so much better when all the cleaning is completed and then I can kind of like get ready and relax for the rest of the day and just do whatever I want to do. But Sunday mornings, this is kind of always me. I do also pop some of this Sephora in the scent country garden in the room as well. I put this in every single room with a bit of hot water and that just kind of scents the room with the steam that comes off it. So that's a good idea if you want to scent your rooms a really nice smell. And I do also put it in when I mop the floors as well. So I'm just wiping the surfaces with these uh, biodegradable wipes, antibacterial wipes, and I don't go crazy like this. This is not a deep clean. This is just a little weekly kind of go over clean. It's nothing, you know, that's going to really thoroughly clean like the sink or anything like that. But it, if you keep on top of it every single week, it's not too, too bad. But at some point I will give everything a thorough you know, 100% clean, but it's not possible for me to do that every single week. I also thought to mention that if you haven't watched any of my holiday vlogs from when I went to Mallorca, you might not know um, that I am pregnant. Obviously, I mentioned it at the start of this video when I talked about becoming a member and joining my channel. But yes, I am pregnant. I am 22 weeks pregnant as I'm filming this and, you know, doing the voiceover. And I am having a girl. So I know the gender and obviously that means I can think of names and I can, you know, start thinking about things to buy for the baby and stuff. It's kind of that sort of stage. Um, but I just thought to mention it here in case you hadn't actually watched those Mallorca videos and you didn't actually know that I am actually pregnant. So there we go. But like I said, you can join as a member if you want to see more info about that and more kind of story times about my journey with that because it's not been like a hundred percent easy but that's totally up to you if you want to join or not
So my bath is my least favorite thing to clean. I hate it because it gets all these like weird kind of like, I don't know what to call it, but like gunky brown stuff around it, which is not dirt necessarily. I know what it's from. It's from my face masks. And yeah, it's so annoying because they just create that kind of tide line around your bath. And I just find it so annoying to clean with wipes. You do really need just like a proper scrubber to do it. So I haven't like left the bath looking beautifully today because it's just too much effort every single week to do it. And to be honest with you, I don't really care. Like if I had people over every single day using the bath, then yeah, fair enough. I would clean it a lot more. But I think this looks okay. Like you can still see the tide lines, but it's it's not too bad. I love to scent the room with the fabric spray and also a Febreze spray. Oh my God, I love this scent. I can't remember what it's called, but it just smells so nice. And it just finishes off the room. Like once I've done all of my cleaning, my hoovering, my mopping, absolutely everything, just to scent the room kind of just finishes everything off. But yeah, that's everything for the clean today. So thanks for watching this section of the video and I'll see you next week. Me and Jamie are out taking the dogs for a walk. We're gonna go to like this car, like vintage car fair thing. Um, it's only gonna be like a little thing, so we'll, I might show a few clips, but we'll go there for a bit. We finished cleaning. Jamie helped me clean. He hoovered and he carpet foamed the living room floor and he actually carpet foamed it better than I've ever done it before. <laughs> all, all near the front door area was completely clean and normally I can't get it fully clean. So that was good. But it'll be interesting to see how the dogs react on this walk because there'll be a lot of people and Cupcake and Teddy are not good with people. So uh, we'll see. If they're really bad, I'll probably film it and show you how bad they are. It'll be funny. Is it on? I think so. Yeah. Cakey, <laughs> guess who's here? Hi, <laughs> We just got home. I did my makeup a little bit more because we're going to be going out for a meal for like a roast, hopefully, if they're still doing the roast. Um, we went to the classic car thing and the dogs were barking a lot. I didn't film them because it was quite intense. Um, and also we had a little instant with Teddy where this is the first time this has ever happened. Like my dogs have never done this before. Um, but people were just coming up to the dogs and just touching them. And I always think like, don't go and touch someone else's dog unless you like know they're friendly or you know the dog. But this lady did kind of put her hand in Teddy's mouth and he bit her hand and she was bleeding. And then he went to bite her again on her leg. Um, he's a Shih Tzu, he's not like a scarily massive dog but it's really bad and I told him off obviously but that's the first time that any of my dogs have ever bitten somebody like that um, unless it was an accident um, but yeah it's just a reminder not to stroke other people's dogs unless you know them um, and also if you do have dogs kind of pull them back from people because you don't want the incident where somebody gets you know bleeding out when they shouldn't be so that is the end of this video. Thank you for watching. Please give the video a thumbs up. Just another reminder, you can join a member, join as a member on my channel if you want to click the um, link which is on my channel, which says join and it's £4.99 a month. And basically you'll get access to two exclusive videos every single week about my pregnancy and my journey with that and story times about that and just, everything relating to that and other kind of exclusive videos that I wouldn't normally post on here. So if you want to join for that just for one month or, you know, however long, then that would really, I would really appreciate that. So thank you. And I will see you in my next video. Goodbye. Next video next week.